Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carly. And I'm Ange. And today we're watching Hunter Hunter episode 77 and 78. So the queen ant is about to shit out the king ant. <laughs> what? Why are you laughing? That's actually what's happening. She's eating a bunch of fish oh and she's God. about to shit out the king ant. <laughs> Alright, yep. <laughs> we also met the 2011 version of Kite. Well, it's not 2011 in their time, but <laughs> in our time it is. And we got to see a little bit of insight into his relationship with both Gon and Jing. Oh my gosh. Kite is the missing Zoldic child. No, I don't think so. Every new character. <laughs> Hilva has taken a strong liking to Kite. Well, not strong, but he respects him, you know? Yeah, yeah, because I think he respects Jing as a hunter. But I don't think anyone can respect Jing. I don't know why people do. <laughs> as a, yeah, as a hunter, yes. As a person. Absolutely not. It's unclear. If you guys are interested in signing up to our Patreon, you'll gain three to four weeks of early access to our current shows, and you'll also gain access to shows that are exclusive to our Patreon. There's also an option to sign up for free if you guys want to get notified whenever we upload. If you're interested, you can check out the link in the description below. But anyway, should we get into it? Let's get into it. I have to tell her, she's not going to do it by shitting. <laughs> I don't know, I have a feeling we're going to get to know the, the Queen Ant a little bit too well. Oh, uh, okay. I kind of, kind of get what I'm saying. Queen Ant crevices and whatnot. Is that what you mean? It's going to be confronting. Wow. It's <laughs> 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 incredible. <laughs> Yeah, I need a breakdown of the ant. I need to know what's going on and how the queen's able to shit out some babies. Yeah. This is the gang. Well, there's only four of them. Five, including Kite. Yeah, but I think you said seven others. Oh. Spin is easier to remember. Yeah, that's great. Oh, yeah, <laughs> she knows that name. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was going to say, they probably heard that name too. <laughs> Dude on the left still looks stressed as. Yeah. Mon. Stick, that's great. Yeah. These names. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Banana. But I've actually forgotten them all already. Stick. Mon. Stick. Spin. Spin. Banana. Banana. I've got it. Come on. <laughs> What's the dog's name? Henry. Like an actual <laughs> normal person name. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, dear. Quite is stressed. Oh, yeah. Oh, he hasn't oh, actually he seen hasn't him. hasn't seen it. It's a myth. And there's her hand. A missing hand. Yeah, there's a lot off about the Queen Ant. There really is. <laughs> City by the ocean. Mm. The ant was by some ocean. Yeah. They've so, probably been um, eaten. Sailed or it got taken away by the current. 
Treating these people with a lot more respect than he did Bisky. Interesting. Yeah, I mean, Bisky had a much different approach. <laughs> I like that guy. Gon's probably the only one that's laughed at that guy, though. <laughs> Wow. He'll soon come to realize that Gon's as psychotic as, as his father, so. Yep. <laughs> Look, she's creating a massive... What? Turd. Oh no, did she fertilize herself already? Yeah, you're right. She needs humans. I did say that. I said specific. No, I said specifically. Gone and Killua. Yeah, uh, but maybe not. I don't know if they're gonna meet just now. That's another word for shit. Wow. Oh, it's gonna be like okay. a bat fish and thing. <laughs> Human bat fish. No. Oh, oh, that's cool. Okay. Was that those other ants? Oh no, they're probably bigger. Yeah. Kali, I gotta say it. I think the queen ant is a top waifu. The fact that she'd do that for her what? husband. I, I'm just saying. The fact her she, husband. She did all it's that. Her. Quite a sacrificial being. <laughs> oh shit. Now this will be my favorite arc. Is, I can just tell. It's gonna be bad. The snake will come back for revenge. 100%. <laughs> I feel uneasy. About to get swallowed by an ant. You know it for a fact. Why is she acting like... This was normal behaviour. Like, praise your son! <laughs> oh, it's not... I think it's there just a maid or something like that. Oh. Don't get attached to the curb. I'm not getting attached to the mum. That's the vibe I'm feeling. Yeah, something's wrong. I don't yeah. I don't think it's the actual mum. Uh, okay. Uh, so I misread that subtitle. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh yeah, my look how, gosh! How different Shut. all of them look. I don't want the details. Oh, okay, alright. Yeah, the kids are about to get swallowed by these bloody ants, Carly. Oh my gosh! And they can fly and swim and stuff. Been working hard. She has been. It's been a hustle. Yeah, I have to respect her for that. I hate to say it, but I do. Oh. <laughs> You're dying. You're dying. Well, maybe it is their mum. I, I didn't. Their mom. I got tricked with the subtitle for some reason. It's okay. There's no way. Who's there to save them? Looks like that thing from Ratchet and Clank. Oh, it's not the time. I mean, they're about to get shredded. Well, he's just supposed to take them there. 
Does this ant look like it's about to reason with the kid? <laughs> he can't eat it, the kid. <gasps> that queen is going to not think twice, probably going to rip the limbs off the kid to consume it easier. Raina and Kurt. Yeah, that was sickening, man. I didn't expect that. I know we haven't really spoken about it yet, but the guy who looks like a bear human. You know that guy, the Daru looking one? Yeah. Do we think the same sort of thing happened to him as Melody? Like the song? Oh yeah, I didn't really take notice to it. That's a good point. Quite possibly. Or well, maybe it's like a chimera moment that didn't go too wrong. Oh yeah, okay. There's <laughs> gonna be a very disturbed mother. Oh wait, no, that wasn't in. No, you was it? No, no, no. no. Oh. Can be more human like. Nah, they're like at the end of the. Okay, I take it back. I thought they went for ages. Oh, they're getting more intelligent. This is obviously Kurt. Disgusting. Where's Nina? This dude needs to be stopped immediately. Can he be changed back? No, Kurt's done. Forget Kurt. <laughs> That's finished. Very rapid reproduction. <laughs> oh, I mean, shit. That's just great. Wow. <laughs> Gonna create a bloody hybrid army. Eat everyone. Create the biggest king we've ever seen. Yeah. Take over the earth. Oh dear. No joke, if I saw that. Yeah. Yeah, I know. He doesn't open his mouth to talk. Huh? Yeah. It's even scarier. Or it's just lack of budget in the oh, animation. No. This is so messed up. And she doesn't get full. She got a she no. got a very good metabolism. Oh yeah. Goodness sake. <laughs> Why is everyone shitting all the time, man? Yeah. This ain't just shit. That's what their family are built on. <laughs> Fight has been uneasy for the yeah. last couple of episodes. Yeah, he knows how bad the situation is. I thought it was not going to lie, but okay. <laughs> My fault. <laughs> oh my gosh! What the heck? Why? Okay, they like to live in the old times. Right. Now we're making, making it a competition. He's going to kill him in a minute. He does open his mouth to talk. Okay. <laughs> this is not his sister. The hair. 
Carly. Don't be, don't be saying this sort of shit. <laughs> These ants are gonna. <laughs> oh my gosh, man! They're all psychotic. I know. Oh, poor woman. Oh dear. No! Uh. They've come to raid the village. I think you were right. Kurt's about to eat his mum. The mum's gonna come back and everyone's gonna be gone. Oh. Is that Rainer? What? No. Maybe only Kurt was taken. Oh, okay, so he can feel emotions. Okay, no. My bad. Yeah, but that was interesting. He can... He felt something there. He recognised his mum. Mm. Okay. There you yes. go. Yes! Let's go, Gyro. Yiro. Who's Yiro? Oh, the hard shell. You're lucky. Stupid piece of trash. That ant would be wrapped that he ate a tortoise or a turtle. Oh, yeah. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. <laughs> He's growing on me. Yeah, I like him. B squared? Aww. Is that why they hate technology so much? Like, what's the deal? Mm. Oh, it's, um... Oh, yeah. Ponzu. That is a good memory. I forgot this one's name, though. <laughs> okay. We're gonna have a reunion. Oh, she didn't get it yet. Yeah. That's right. Killua ruined that for everyone. Ah! <laughs> Savage. Right, so they just think everyone's going to be snitching on them <laughs> and their, their bad practices or private practices. <laughs> Kali, what's his name? I need some help here. I can't help you. <laughs> Shit. Fair enough. At least he they can look them. after themselves. Yeah. They're going to do a full circle moment. I just saw it. I just saw it. I just saw it in my head. I'll explain later. Okay. I just saw it. All right. I can see it. Nah, Gon won't do that. He'll help him if he needs to. <laughs> they got the professor reading up on everything to do with humans. He's kind of cute too. <laughs> I need to see Yiro. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Wow, mm -hmm. she's making a loudspeaker announcement. Oh my gosh. That right now. Oh. That's fair. I mean, that would make it easier for us, too, so... Yeah. What do you reckon her name would be? She's giving Gwyneth. I don't want to offend any females that might be watching, so I'm not going to... Okay. I'm not going to give out a name. Sorry, Gwyneth. Just, just in case, Carly. <laughs> Carly, say sorry to Gwyneth. Oh, what? No way. Oh, the Gwyneth's watching. There could be a Gwyneth. Sorry to the Gwyneth's watching. 
We're getting too intimate with Gwyneth. I don't like the angles and stuff that they're doing. Gwyneth, Gwyneth a waifu? I said that before. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, okay, so we're upgrading here. Mm. I like it how there's like a, a pyramid of authority here. Yeah, the hierarchy. <laughs> That's what I said. Yeah, I was more getting at like, I feel like it's going to be a full circle moment with Kite. And I actually think Kite might try to protect Gon like when they first met. Right. That's what I was trying to get at. I was going to yeah, wait till the discussion, call. but I think that's what's going to happen. And they did it with Kurt and Reiner as well. Oh, is it actually Reiner or Reina? Reina. 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 I think it's Reina. Reina, like Nina. Fitting. Oh, great. Cruel fate, the narrator says. <laughs> so we learnt a little bit more about these ants. So yeah. it's pretty cool the way they've been written where the queen ant has this special function, photosynthesis. <laughs> photosynthesis. Okay, I've forgotten the word. Something genesis. <laughs> Essentially, when she eats beings, the offspring end up having traits of what she's eaten. Yeah, all of the DNA is like passed on to her big turd, which yeah. is then turned into a chimera. Yeah, massive Science shit. Science and stuff. Yeah, massive shit. And we're about to get introduced to like the the bodyguards or the, yeah. the the three what were they called? The king's three royal guards. They're gonna be a pain in the ass, you know for a fact. We can see their silhouettes a little bit now. You can see that one of them's got wings. One of them looks like a ladybug. They don't look too scary right now, but yeah, I'm sure they'll be pretty tough. We also met some of Kite's friends. Mm. We'll probably grow to like quite a few of them. I hope they're great Nen users. Because they're going to need it. Back to my full circle moment thing. Yeah, what did, I like what, that. What did Kite say? He said, um, if you're in trouble, I'll be forced to stay or something like that. No, or, he said, if you're in trouble, you have to run. I have to help my friends first. Yes, yeah, yeah. If I'm in trouble, you have to save yourselves. Yeah. Now, sure, it could be as simple as um, what you and Gon were saying. Gon's obviously going to try to help who he can. Like, we just know yeah. he's going to do that. I more thought it was going to maybe go the other way and they were going to do something nice, how Kite was kind of put out by having to save Gon um, and take a, uh, for interfering with nature or whatever was happening there. I just felt like something similar was going to happen again. And the way we introduced the Kite, or at least in the nine, 1999 version, was going to be similar to how maybe Kite treats Gon later on. Mm, yeah, I really like that. I didn't even think about that. But yeah, I think that relates to Kurt and Rena. His little sister as well, like how he tried to protect her too. Yeah, and then not only that, I think they're, they're going to make a big thing about how much Jing influenced Kite or how much of a liking Kite took to Jing. Yeah, it might try to pay that respect by saving his son. Mm. I don't know. I felt like it was very purposeful when they said when he said that. Cause... Yeah, he, he thanked him for punching his son. So do we think uh, Kite is going to... Punch gone to get him out of the way of danger or something. No, I, I don't think they, I don't think it would be that that specific. But I don't know. I'm just getting a vibe. It was a snake that kite saved gone from in the 1999 version, episode one, wasn't it? First, and then the rat bear came along. <laughs> the rat bear. Yeah, hmm. I think so. It was interesting how one of the chimera ants had a little bit of human emotion. Definitely, that was definitely visible to us. Yeah. And it was confusing, the ant. Now, I know you're calling him Kurt. Are we Are we doing that? Are we like... Well, we'll wait until they give themselves names. Yeah, I don't think it's that simple. I think that... Don't they just transform into a new being with just a little bit of... But, I don't know, he could seem like... Because he re obviously remembered who his mum was. Yeah. But it doesn't seem like Kurt. It doesn't even look or sound like well, Kurt. Well, he's all merged with all the other DNA yeah. and stuff. Yeah, yeah, some sort of hybrid thing there going on, but... um. It's something to keep in mind because I have a good feeling that amongst these ants, these chimera ants, 
there'll be a couple that maybe don't fall in line with the king and the queen and what oh, they want. I a think couple we, of Rogans. We could have some Rogans that maybe, I don't know, we end up siding with or something. Like like there's going to be an up uprising. No, not an uprising. I just think there'll be maybe an ant that we come to like because they're not like the rest or something like that. That's a vibe I'm okay. getting. Because there's a lot that the ants don't understand about the humans. Yeah. You saw one of them trying to read up all these books, but I think... The penguin. Yeah. <laughs> they'll they'll quickly understand that humans are very complex and there might actually be one that overthrows them. Mm. You reckon it would be the Kurt ant? I'm getting a vibe from him. I think they set it up quite well in this episode. Yeah. Yeah, even like the little things, like the conversation he was having with the crocodile ant. Yeah, who you said was Rena, which <laughs> I'm finding really funny. That's going to be hilarious. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't know what's happened there, but yeah, <laughs> something's off. Um, yeah, he didn't really want to take any part of that. He wasn't interested in competition and, I don't know, maybe he, maybe he feels like this shouldn't be a sport. He shouldn't be sporting like... I'm going to keep an eye on him. Yeah. I'm okay. going to wait for the code name and then I'm going to keep an eye on him. Okay. I mean, he has taken a few people, but... Yeah. He seems okay mm-hmm. so far. I'm hoping they get really creative with the higher-ups and the king and mm, all of that. When they start becoming more and more human, yeah. I definitely think they will. Yes. Yeah, because she's eating like 50 humans a day now. Can you imagine the... Oh, uh, well, she's not actually creating the army anymore. She's ready to go into labor now. Yeah, well, I'm also wondering what the power difference would be because let's remember that we got some pretty powerful sort of Nen users here. Yeah, I'm wondering how they compare. Yeah, we've got the not gonna lie countrymen too, who seem to take <laughs> down some of the the lower end ants with just pretty easily. Yeah, with just well, I say just, but yeah, with guns. Yeah, but like a gun in comparison to a crazy a- Nen user is like. Not much, right? A, a gun in anime is generally like a water pistol. Yeah. You know? Yeah. There's better and more powerful things that they can be using. I'm curious as to whether or not any of these uh, made-up countries that we were introduced to were um, based off of any real countries. You know how the writers try to be creative like that sometimes. Yeah. Or um, take inspiration from, like, real-life places. I'm sure people will let us know. I'm sure there's plenty of uh, that sort of... Riding in Hunter Hunter. Yeah, well, York New might be New yeah. York. Yeah, you'd imagine so. Yeah. Yeah. I have a prediction. Yeah. The dog's getting taken and eaten. No, I just think they'll eat most of Height's friends. No. Yeah, that's I'm thinking I'm getting. long term now. I'm thinking there has to be some sort of Nen healing that can put all the animals back to their original form. I know this goes against other Chimera law that we've learnt in other TV series yeah. or animes, but I'm just hoping that this anime is an exception. I don't think so. I don't know if they're going to be saved. I think they're done. Maybe Jin can do it, but <laughs> okay. we don't know what Jin can do. It's a really long arc, so I, I'm sure there are endless possibilities. I'm sure this is not just the only bit of world building that's going to take place, mm. you know, about the queen. We have to wait for the king. Can't wait to see him. The king and then the royal guards and all that sort of shit. Um, so they're going to be heaps of fights. Too. All the food she's eaten mm. in like the last, however no, long we've known her for, the fish, the humans, everything. All of that DNA goes into the king. Like, what? What is the plan here? We can yeah. expect to see like basically a very human-like that's, king. That's what I'd imagine. It's I reckon be like cell. Yeah, I think it's your vibes about the cell sort yeah. of thing was very spot on. But I think it'll be even like more human than that. I right. I'm actually gonna go ahead and say that I reckon the king will be will literally resemble a human. Okay, interesting. Or close to because they're gonna realize well they're realizing how how sped up the process has been by eating all these humans. Mm. You'll notice probably the royal guards look even more human like, and then the king will probably just be a human. Okay, they could do a cool like symbolic play on that. Yeah, like, they can do you heaps know, you with can it. Look like a human. You can try and deceive the humans, but you're not. Yeah, I'm sure they'll do plenty of that sort of thing. I've heard great things about the arc. I think I will enjoy it the most out of the other ones. It's also the longest. Yeah. And I like big build ups for for stronger payoffs later on. So if it's that sort of vibe, then I'm mm. I'm very much uh, excited to watch the rest of it. 
But yeah, maybe in the in the next couple of episodes, I'd hope to see maybe the Royal Guards, just so we can kind of see how they're progressively looking. Yeah, um, I expect they're not going to make us wait too long to see that. No. I would even hope to see the King in the next coming episodes as well. I'm not sure. It's got to, like, really play out over time. I don't know how it's going to be such a long, yeah. long arc if they do that. I'm not entirely sure. I'd imagine we're going to start to see some creative fights later on with some of the big boy mm, ants. Yeah. Uh, because I think the one, the chimeras that we've seen so far, they're like, they're nothing. Yeah. They'll be dealt with really quickly by characters like Gon and Kite and all that. Yeah. But then you've got the Queen, probably going to be a big issue. The Royal Guards are going to be very much big mm. issues. And then the King, I mean, shit. I reckon the Queen's done after childbirth. Yeah, quite possibly. I reckon then her King probably eats her body and, I don't know. Yeah. She's done. Yeah. I think, th- did they say something like that? Oh no! They said that Maybe she would. She on would. David Attenborough. No, she said that um, she would even eat part of herself or something to to fuel the birth of the king. I don't bloody know, but yeah, that's that seems to be her purpose. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And yeah, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.